That was a good time in my life right there. It's a great time. Great I remember time. listening. When I think of that song, I, I remember crossing the bridge, going back to Orange from Lake Charles. We had just ate some crawfish at Steamboat Beach. <laughs> I was listening to that in my headphones, of course. <laughs> It was a nice weeknight. <laughs> oh, okay. So it's, okay. Okay. You know, I don't know. We did stuff like that on, on, during a weeknight, but we did that. Was, it was who, nice. who was there? Like me, my mama, and my sister. Oh, I okay. assume mm-hmm. Paul, too. Okay. Okay. Why wouldn't he be? But it was us. Okay. Okay. It was like a week. It was probably a Thursday. That sounded like a good vibe Thursday. We had yeah. stopped at the mall afterwards, too. It was a nice <laughs> change of pace. Yeah, for sure. That's for like sure. one of them songs that like put you in like a that I list- can win mood. Yeah. I got I had got asked um uh, one of my songs of success by our brother Coop. Mm-hmm. <laughs> and I sent him a couple of things. He's like, okay, okay. Yeah. So I, I think about that a lot. That's songs of success. Yeah, what are your songs of success? Like when you oh, feel like you question. made it, which one you put on like Yeah, like your Rocky song. Yeah, yeah. Like Eye of the Tiger. What's your Eye of the Tiger? Mm. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Ooh. Is that uh I like Glory by Kanye West. Okay. Is that, th- that's I know, a graduation. Champion, champion huh? I thought well, you were. not ch- champ. Oh, man. Yeah, yeah. Isaac, that's even I know. closer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know, I used to have to listen to that just to get hyped up. <laughs> just, just to get to, just to get through the day. Yeah, champion. <laughs> okay, okay. I like it. I like it. Episode 134. This is the Transfer of Experience Podcast. You're here with your, with your people, man. Uh, gang's all here. Uh, got my boy Bull. Whoa. Got my boy Ed. Yeah. Here. Hey, we got some people in the back. What's up to the people in the back, man? Yo. Hey, we got we got <laughs> hey, we got a live studio. <laughs> got a live audience studio audience. Hey, hey, we got <laughs> hey, hey, we got a live studio audience today. Um and it's a good day, man. Yeah, it, yeah, it, yeah, yeah. It's a good day. It's a good day. So just to get the temperature, temperature of the room, how's everybody feeling? How are things going? Pretty good, man. Pretty good. Almost yeah. through the week, man. Uh-huh. This whole week, I ain't had Emory. Man, it's been pretty quiet at the house. Like, silent. I haven't turned on the TV all uh, week. Okay. Uh, I finished a book this week. I started it Friday, I want to say. Yeah. What okay. you read? I finished the autobiography of Malcolm X. Mm-hmm. Good book. Yeah. yeah. What? No, go ahead. No, no, no. Nah, go it's I, no. <laughs> more informational than anything, or was it like? Nah, so, so that's the thing. Like the education, I don't think informational or whatever. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Well, it was one of those things where, like, one his his personality like shot out of the book. Like as you read the words, you can like see him. Same like way. I felt like I I was sitting across from I him talking to me. Mean, I re- I wrote it myself. Yeah, uh, well, or he like told the story he told to Alex yeah, Haley. Alex Haley. Alex Haley. Yeah. yeah. Um. Wait, ain't that what's the difference? It's a biography, or autobiography. Autobiography is I said these words yeah. and I'm telling the story myself. So Alex Haley. Was oh, the but guy. that don't he necessarily mean everything. you wrote it though. That yeah. just means right. Yeah. Said it. So it's the autobiography of Malcolm X as told by Alex Haley. He did the roots too. Or X told too, mm-hmm. Alex Haley. Is yeah. he alive? No, he died in like mm-hmm. 92. Yeah, something like that. Mm-hmm. Um, but yeah, man, it's I mean, it's it's pretty good. Uh I like I like the parts when he talked about his life and mm-hmm. the yeah. lessons that the things that he did taught him. Yeah. But you can like I said, his his personality was like shooting out of the book because every now and then he go off on a tangent of how the black man, yeah, and yeah. like that. It, yeah, yeah. After like three or four of, like, chapters, he got a lot yeah, of and it's like, and it wouldn't be so bad, but it's like it's probably like seventeen chapters, but it's like in each of like probably like ten chapters is like twenty pages of him just going on the same tangent, and so after but I like it, yeah. But after mm-hmm. a while, I was just like, all right, here it comes. Yeah, <laughs> and so towards the end of the chapter is when he'll like talk about what the chapter is actually about, mm-hmm. and so um, but that was cool. Like he he name dropped a lot of people. He did. Um, like Red Fox, he used to work in a, a restaurant with Red Fox. Mm-hmm. Um, and yeah, man, little stuff like that. The end of it almost made me cry. Yeah, the end of it is because he like the last two pages. He started talking about like he started reflecting, mm-hmm. and he was like, uh, you know, the only thing I wish I could have done was like get a better education like 
Mm-hmm. I would I definitely would have went back to school and I wouldn't yeah. have had no problem with going back to school. But as he's saying this, he's leading up to saying, I know that I'm not going to live to see this book come out. Yeah. Dang. Like he said it, I think, in the book. Yeah, he yeah. said it at the yeah. end of the book. He yeah, said, he said I, yeah. I know that I'm not going to live yeah. to see this come out, but I wish I could have done all of these things. Yeah. Dang. And I was like, dang, bro, that's crazy to know that mm-hmm. somebody about to off you soon. <laughs> And he like I'm talking about this is like January and he got killed in February. Yeah. Oh dang. So it's it was really like so that was probably a priority to to finish it. Yeah. He and he said it in a book too. Like in the last chapter, he was like, you know, I'm not a a person that wastes time, but I spent all my time, all of my free time, to make sure I get this book done and get it out. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But yeah, it's that was your first time reading it. Yeah. Man, I I I started it a few years ago, but I. I like to read the foreword and all of that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But the, his daughter wrote the foreword, and that was also like thirty pages. And I was like, mm-hmm. okay, I guess I don't be, mm-hmm. yeah, like straight to chapter. One. <laughs> yeah, I don't want to see the dedication. You don't yeah. want the shout outs. <laughs> yeah, but it was like, yeah, I, this this is my first time reading it all the way through, and it was really good, and mm-hmm. I appreciated it. That was that was a good a good way to start the year. I need to crack up. That is a good. That's a good palate cleanser. <clears throat> yeah, because I I, I never read that, but I I got a long list. Okay. Like I got like wanna. two books now that I need to, mm-hmm. maybe three that I need to mm-hmm. open and start. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I need to read. More I've been recommending or books lately. Read really. I've been recommending books lately. Like I, I haven't read in. I don't know if I read in twenty twenty three to be transparent. I did. I did. I don't I think didn't I at all. Read. I haven't read none since twenty twenty. Mm. Maybe I twenty. Like I read. A little bit, but I, I I need to get back to it. Mm-hmm. The funny thing is, one thing that like I realized whenever I started reading is that I actually like reading. I'm about to say, and that's the thing, I actually like reading. Yeah, and it's like a, a pleasant surprise. Mm. Like I started reading, and I didn't want to put the book down. That's a good feeling. You know what I'm that's saying? That's you in a good book. Yeah. You know what? I'm not gonna lie. I don't mean to put this on you, but you know what killed my reading momentum? Oh, I, I, yeah, I, yeah, I know what you about okay. to say. He gonna that, say it's because we didn't. We no, used to like. No, no, you sent me a book that Whole Foods book. No, Trader I still Joe, don't remember no, that Whole Foods. Book. I still don't remember that. It was so bad. Like I was I thought, reading actively until then. And are you the talking about Lynchpin? No, it was about the the guy who started Whole Foods. It I was really about that. the guy, but he talked about in his business model. But he talked about Whole Foods. Yeah. Mm-hmm. But it was just so bad. You like, gotta send me the name. Of it that, killed my remember. momentum. Like I, I up until that point, I was reading really good books, so they catch me. Yeah, but that was the first time a book didn't catch me, and I was trying to like push through it, but I couldn't mm-hmm. push through it. Okay. But see, that's the thing. With, that's the thing with me though. If it's a really good book, mm-hmm. and I start reading, I'm not gonna put it down. Yeah. Mm-hmm. But I had I, I've been reading. I, I think I. It was some stinkers that kind of just like derailed. Wasn't and, we all supposed to read the message to the black man? Still ain't read that. I, read I, I think that. I got the book. I got it too. I'm about to say I read that. I got it. Yeah, yeah. yeah I got it. See, that's that's on my list. That I uh, got to fit. Well, I think something I got, about. I think I got like 16 pages in. Yeah, that yeah. book get really militant. No, that's another one yeah, that's no, like no that he, one, that one every gets, chapter, yeah, every section yeah. he's gonna yeah. I think that might have been. I like man, this is very militant. Yeah, that's what I say. That's yeah, yeah. As soon as I crack a book open and read a page and actually like it, it's gonna be easy. Just getting mm-hmm. to that point, I just gotta sit myself down yeah. and focus. That'd be my issue or just too. read like the first three pages. But like, that, you don't know if there. you want to keep going. Yeah. But that'd be my issue too. I don't have. Like my most of my sit down time is at work. Mm-hmm. Like I'm normally doing like actively moving mm-hmm. in my downtime. Like I like moving. Yeah. But I think I'm gonna do the I think I'm gonna start Monday. Just at least read one chapter a night. I know people that do that. Just one yeah. chapter. I know yeah. people that do thirty yeah. minutes. Just Yeah, they just they read one chapter. Mm-hmm. Just so they can read, but I guess they don't wanna I guess I don't know. I forgot why she told me she did that. Mm-hmm. But yeah. she says, "Yes, yeah, she would read." I was like, "Man, that's not like a healthy habit to just read one." I guess too, because it don't put too much on you to yeah. where you'd be like, mm-hmm. ah, "But you know, one chapter, mm-hmm. 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 you can get through that, and then you done." Yeah, at yeah. least Monday, yeah, you got to stop and pull. At least Monday yeah. through Thursday, when my life really structured, yeah, I can that, do that. Yeah. yeah, you can, and you can do that before you go to bed. Yeah, like, you can. Yeah, I'm gonna say it's it's a lot of 
easy time you can implement one. Ch- I'm gonna start that Monday. You gotta ask me about that next week. Okay, I'm gonna ask you about that because I, I like I said I got a running list of books physically yeah. in my home. So. I'm about to say that you have. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That I need to read. Yeah, see that's the that difference. Was, uh, I don't, I, the books I want to read, I don't have them. No, I got. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah. no, nah, I got like. Yeah. Y'all seen my book show? I about to say it's, I do got some ones in there. But yeah, I got. I guess it. I should finish. Me- well, but say, and that's what I had yeah. always prided myself to. Like, I always like the books I had. You can point to, and I'm like, oh yeah, that was about. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't yeah. have no empty calories. Now yeah. I got like empty. Like I got some empty calories. Yeah. I got about some placeholders. I got yeah, about four. <laughs> yeah, books, maybe five, bro. I need to lock in for yeah. real. For real, I got a few autobiographies. Like I'm, I, I finished the Malcolm X book yesterday. Is that was that yesterday? I put in the group message. Mm-hmm. I finished it yesterday, and today I started the autobiography of uh, Dick Gregory. So you reading? Oh yeah, that's a See, good I, one. Oh, you you in the full swing of You know what? I gotta, oh yeah, like I'm. I gotta read Scarface book. I heard it was good. I actually read that. I know you, you read it. I have that book too. Yeah. Can yeah. I? Can I, I might have to. It? Yeah. Yeah. I might give it. I might have to no? order that mug. No. Okay. I'll, I'll order it. it. <laughs> I'm like, traumatized. I know when a man asks to borrow a book, I ain't gonna never get it back. That's why I made that face. But I you like, come I here. Like that book. You come here. Yeah, but no, that's gonna not... be that awkward. <laughs> where I'm like, how you coming along on the book? You know, I ain't started. I'm like, oh, okay. Uh, hey, I need that back, player. <laughs> I just I know and I give a book out, but I like spread not, but I low key like the aesthetics of that book too, though. That's why. Okay. But you okay. can you can borrow it though. <laughs> borrow. Hey, uh, uh, I'm sorry. I know this uh, hard left. No, maybe take right. It. I don't know. Take it. Pause. No. Wow. I don't want to. That's crazy. Yeah, that's crazy. Resume. Oh, okay. Yep. But uh, <laughs> yeah, I know when I first moved into my apartment. My curtain rod was too long for my room. Mm-hmm. Right. I finally ordered one after. How long ago was that? When I moved in, no October, October, November, mm-hmm. maybe. Yeah, October. So, no, that was September. September before oh, my birthday. Oh my gosh, thaw me out. That nah, was, was that before my? What birthday? did you do for your birthday? Nothing. We was here. Uh uh-uh. uh, it was after. It was October. no, it was before because it was before the weekend of your grandmother's birthday. Anyway, awkwardly, like I should know my grandma's birthday is. That's why it was that pause. I was like, oh, I don't still don't know what that is. September okay. 16th. No, it, it was the day before you know I, I proposed. That's the only reason I it remember. It was September because I definitely was fired and tried to apply for unemployment for sure. And by my, <laughs> by my birthday. Yeah. But with the Buddha birthday is in August. August. 13. But you told me that then. Yeah, that was still ongoing. I'm just talking about. Oh yeah, yeah. I get what you're saying. Yeah, I get what you're saying. Yeah, yeah. It was well, I've been there October, November, December, four month. Uh-huh. Light just shining in my room. <laughs> Can't uh-huh. sleep. Uh-huh. Well, it wasn't that bad. It wasn't like that bad, but it would definitely be bright. But I get to sleep in darkness again. I, I uh, ordered me a, a rod, which is only twelve dollars from Amazon. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Sometimes it's just got to just do it. Then yeah. shout out to you, man. Mm-hmm. Yeah. The. Uh, Command strip hooks, yeah, mm. man. Rods, they're different. Mm-hmm. But I had to like, you know, how you gotta like measure it. And- I don't have the ability to level stuff mm-hmm. when I'm not on my feet. Like if it's a ladder involved and I gotta like, be like suspended level right. something because mm-hmm. when you gotta move the ladder over, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. it just always go wrong. And I know the the pencil trick, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. it don't work for me. I don't know. Mm-hmm. You should have told me. I got the uh, the one that you stick on the wall. Bless you. Mm-hmm. You stick on the wall and it's a laser and it shoot it. Bless you. And it shoot across. You just but put the hooks I, in the I, I, I eyeballed it though. And no, I did okay. Okay. Well, the first, because I started on one side because I, I decided I was going to do three hooks. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And then the, the middle one was a little too high. So I tried to take it off. Man. Yep. That took the paint smooth off them yep. things. Stick, uh, stick. Yeah. yeah. But did you get the ones where you pull it? Look. So you pull yeah. the adhesive yeah. and it pulls straight down so yeah. it don't pull out the paint. If you try to like pull yeah. it like this, because it's like dang near liquid cement. Yeah. I know I know what you're talking about. You know what I'm talking about? Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna need you gotta pull that straight yeah. down. Straight down, right? Yeah, you pull it straight down and the adhesive just pulls. Mm-hmm. Oh yeah. yeah I tried right. to like peel it off. Like yeah, uh, yeah. it ain't a peel. Yeah, thing. Nah, it's you know, you gotta but it's good that you got three though because I'm pretty well, no, sure. No, those the pack things. came with a lot of them. Yeah, but yeah. I just needed three. But well I'm yeah. just saying because if you just do two, and I know them curtains kind of heavy, yeah, with yeah, the rods, it'll yeah, the mugs will fall off. So you need to use like, and Probably you got two windows, right? So you put one in the middle, or is it one just one big window? You talking about like curtains? 
No, the no, it's window. just one window. Okay, well, okay, but it's two panels. Yeah, but yeah, yeah so yeah, they was like let it sit for twenty four hours before you like put the rod on. That's yeah. why I couldn't bring you your ladder because of, it's okay. I was like, well, I'm gonna put them on today. Mm-hmm. I was like, man, sleeping in darkness, that's gonna be another level. I ain't slept in darkness in a while, physically. You need that. So I man, I'm looking forward to that. Okay, man. okay, it's okay. Pitch black. Okay. Cause like I said, that light be shining in. It don't bother. <laughs> you know, you just get used to stuff over time. Yeah, mm-hmm. yeah, yeah. But that'd be different walking in the room. It's just pitch black. That's I'm a different. Forward to that. That's a different mode. But I don't think I ever slept like that in pitch black. Shit, mm-hmm. I have. Bro, it's a game. Yeah, yeah. I'm about to say that that's sun, that sun wake me up every morning. Mm. Oh, well, he might need, need to. Yeah, yeah. Well, I'm about to say, and I also read somewhere that it's better to wake up like that than to like wake up. Alarm. To an alarm or wake up to mm-hmm. like darkness because then your brain don't mm-hmm. yeah oh, you, kick start. Maybe yeah. that's why. Uh, well, no, I wake up when it's dark outside though, so yeah. it don't really help. I'm gonna say you way. got an alarm too. Well, yeah, but I was like, even if I didn't have the alarm, I, I I wake up and go to work when it's dark outside. So yeah. mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I, I, I did that. I wouldn't wake up till seven something. Yeah, when sunrise is, but. I'm about to say, if there wasn't no light in my room, I ain't waking up. But nah, those curtains, though, all that to say, that's been probably the biggest development in my life in the past <laughs> week. <laughs> okay. that's, I'm really excited about that. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Because, man, I've been needing that. You know, like, when you finally, like, you've been knowing you need to get something done, but you just been BSing. Yeah. Like, mm-hmm. it wasn't no reason. Well, one, I didn't know Ross was that cheap, but still, like, I didn't. I could have been bought some rods regardless, but right. just right. dragging, just looking at the curtains on the ground right there uh-huh. and having his ladder hostage for apparently four months. I didn't know it had been that long. I didn't even realize I didn't have a ladder. I forgot that's I how bought you know a ladder. That's how you know you had it for a long time. Yeah, I was yeah. saying, I forgot I, I had a ladder. I forgot I had a ladder. Yeah. Yeah. And I'd be pressed to give people their stuff back, but like I say, I dragged my feet so long. And, uh-huh. uh, so it was just nice to like, you know, get something done. You've been yeah. needing to get done. I also went by the post office today because I've been needing to ship something. I, it'd be like them little small wins, man. <laughs> I'd be needing them sometime. Yeah, no. Cool. Um, my week has been good, man. It's been a very busy week for me. Mm-hmm. Um, well, first of all, I, I start with this. Thanks for the bowling. Oh, yeah, man. Bowling was nice. Oh, yeah. Bowling was real nice. Yeah. That was a good brotherly time. Yeah. Like, I told somebody I was like we had a good time with my brothers that was yeah. like a, just a you know with, with the guys yeah. with the guys with the it's life. different I like it's bowling different. yeah it's a metaphor for life in there when it comes mm-hmm. to bowling yeah it is I about to say especially that last time <laughs> it's a metaphor for life you know, when it comes to bowling man. Some, some people some people let that thing wave or some I, people I bought it that last game when I bowled 120 yeah you did that yeah I'm not used to beating you too, so I've been really enjoying it. I'm not gonna lie, I've been thoroughly enjoying it. The actually. first game with my claim to fame, yeah, my comeback had a little comeback. I'm about to say the uh-huh. yeah the your first game you played, I wasn't like you beat me. Yeah, like, I, both no, I, I beat think me. you. I you came. Won. You won. Oh, I won. Oh, yeah. no, because no, I won. won. No, you won. No, you won. I came back. I won uh, the first one that we did. I'm about to say I, I, I know I won three out of four games. Mm-hmm. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. I came back. That was a good comeback because I was down. Yeah. Then I just, you know, got it to my. See, I just, I don't think I've ever had a game where I didn't get a hundred. Oh my goodness. Yeah, because you had ninety four and ninety eight. Mean slump. And then I like had sixty that last game. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it was bad. But But I don't see. I guess I don't look at bowling numbers like that. I just do it. You know what I mean? It's one of the things I just do. You know, because it's that type of activity for me. Yeah. You know what I mean? But I, I liked like it, it, though, because it was cool. I think, too, for me, like, since it's such a physical thing, it's like the more you do it, the more you can just consistently mm-hmm. do like what you do. Muscle yeah, memory, yeah. Yeah, yeah but you got to do it often. You know what you do right. Yeah, but this is the, the mm-hmm. most I've ever bowled in my life. And it ain't like we've just been that many times. I just, yeah. I don't ever bowl this often. See, that Like in 23, see, I bowl, I think. Maybe two, three times. See, that's what I need to do. I need to go more consistently. Because, mm-hmm. like, I'll be good for a game and yeah. a half. Then it's just like, all right. But if I, I love it, bowling. But if I do it more consistently, I know because I can, I can pattern it down. Yeah. Because I know how it's supposed to. Cause you know your saying? little hop skip is my favorite thing in the world. But I say, yeah, yeah you, you, it's, it's you a, got it's, a smooth motion to your bowling. All right. It's just, you know, alley cat strike, you know. But I say, you. 
Because <laughs> you bowl straight naturally. Yeah. So I once do. you learn how to bowl consistently straight, which it's, is it's follow. This is my follow through. It's, it's harder than it seems, man. Oh, I, I can't answer it. I, no, it's I only for you. I focus. You, your thing is your thing. Yeah, say, at say. a certain point, I'm a buy a ball. Yeah, you need that. Like one day I'm gonna walk in that thing and I'm gonna have a bowling bag. See, yeah, I'm, thing is, I'm, going, I'm gonna have to be yeah. that the, that guy with the the one that can hold a few. Cause yeah, yeah. I like I, I like different weights at different times. Oh, you yeah. did switch your you did switch yeah a couple of weights. Like I like to start off with eight to warm up. Then when I get properly looped, ten is mine. I like That's to go mine. to ten. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Ten but then sometimes I be needing that twelve because sometimes a heavier weight will help me bowl straighter because it keep me honest in my. Mm-hmm. You can't I, just yeah. I can't. Just, you can't be flimsy with. Yeah, you, I yeah. can't just go off the reservation. And I, I'll stay in my lane easier, pun mm-hmm. intended. But uh, mm-hmm. yeah, man, I I, I know because mm-hmm. the last time I was I, I was bowling eight, then I was like, man, this. I need a little bit more. Like I'm, yeah. I like, like I, I can. I kind of started overshooting it. Yeah, but, well, let me yeah. get that ten. And but get, I like. But I need that eight to warm up. I like Ed progression because it's like it's so it's like cool that it's violent at the end. <laughs> like it's it's so violent at the end. Like you know, oh, man. and I was like, I was like. I'm a very eccentric bowler. You don't know Everybody. you are. No, it's not. It's not even a bad because it's because it's your thing, you know. Yeah. Because I do my little hop skip, you know. Yeah, and I saw that. I was like, I was like, he's so violent, but it worked. It worked. I'm about to say it's at the end is when he like put the the spin on it. So that, it he like put the spin on it to where he can make sure it's on all, that thing. And also, and also, he laid that thing down. Yeah. <laughs> I'm talking about he. You know what I'm saying? Oh, yeah, yeah, if I'm trying to pose. Yeah, yeah. Then yeah. I, I'm going to say often, like, bro, I'd, like, be, like, where I'd be sore, you shouldn't be sore from bowling. Because, you know, I'd, I'd be dang near on the ground sometimes after the mm-hmm. after I bowl, yeah. depending on if I'm trying to look to see what it's going to do and stuff. That's why I say I'm mm-hmm. very mm-hmm. eccentric when it comes to bowling. got to have loose pants on because I'm going to get low. Mm. Yeah. Like, it, it's a lot. It's a full body. Bowling is a full body thing. This is the first sure. time I was like sore from bowling. Like my shoulder. All I the wasn't way. sore. But I was sore in my glutes. That's it. I yeah. sure. Like I said, I was squatting and just, but Usually my shoulder was, wasn't. But I started room. like doing, like I started really like trying to kill the pins at yeah, a certain point in time. I was, was like, conviction. yeah, I was yeah, like, he sure was. I stopped was trying like, to like do my like little bowling and. No, nah, I just straight down the Cause middle. Because I was like, dang, I wish. Because uh, you know, a lot of bowling alleys that have like the, which I don't know how accurate it is, but it had like the speedometer and tell you how fast. Yeah, how fast mm-hmm. it go. I was like, I love to see that because at that, yeah, some of them, he was like, he was getting that ball down there. I was like, mm-hmm. I was about to say, it should. I, well, we can't remember, but on the TV, they'll have it. I was mm-hmm. looking, or maybe I wasn't looking in the right. Because yeah. it's normally like in the bottom right hand mm-hmm. corner. But yeah. Mm-hmm. I don't think I seen it. Yeah. But yeah, mm-hmm. I, I love to know because you was. Yeah, yeah. at a certain that point when I couldn't get when I couldn't get to what I needed, I was like, "Yeah, nah, bro. Yeah. I just gotta toss that thing down." I say, it me when people were just like when they be jokingly, they like just straight up shot put that thing. Yeah, yeah. that's down bowling wise for me personally, personal preference. It be cringy them bowlers with a ball don't touch the it's about halfway down the lane. Yeah, they really be yeah, throwing nah. it. I had a guy there doing it. I yeah. be like, bro, don't do that. Yeah, yeah nah. Yeah. The only time like I'll do that if I have a heavier ball and I need like a good spin on it, I'll throw it a little bit more in the air, but I'm not like tossing that mug no, yeah, from that up mug here. Yeah. Like, nah. It don't go touch to halfway down. I'm like, I don't think that's I, it's not even safe, oh. bro. That like really mess up the lane. I'm about to say, I, I would imagine because that's wood, so it can't just. It ain't meant to do that. Yeah, mm-hmm. no. But but I like. So where we going again? It's a, it's a good clean activity. We can. I was about to the say next, if we weren't doing Friday. something. Yeah, I'm about to yeah. say the next Friday. I as I say, that's my thing on Fridays. I would like, love that to be after ten o'clock. Is I about to say I would love to be my weekly thing because I I can get good at that. I about to say I can spare what was it thirty dollars? I can spare thirty dollars for. Mm-hmm. Unlimited. On a Friday, yeah, and, and it's eight. unlimited. Give me four, five games, mm-hmm. yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. That's all I need too. About mm-hmm. four, five, yeah, yeah. That was a uh, that I am kind of surprised though, because that was. But I think having you there kind of helped me body wise because it slowed it down <laughs> a little bit more. Because yeah, when it's two people, it can it can be it rapid. go quick. It's rapid. It fire. go quick. Mess around and finish a game in twenty minutes, and mm-hmm. yeah, now you on to we, the next one, yeah. We, 
talk a little bit. Yeah, <laughs> slow it down. Yeah, nah. And I am the type of person that like I don't. Bro, we be stop. Getting, we get like I just really quick. Go yeah. and go and go. But mm-hmm. yeah, I was about to say like if if you would have said that earlier in the week, I wouldn't have tried to do the game night. No, nah, that's fine. No, I, I I like activities. So yeah, I'm about to like, say. I like activities. So oh, we'll get clean. Hobby, but man. Yeah. that's how it started. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Um, and Definitely then, might look into getting the ball. I didn't even think about getting the ball. Like Amazon. I said, I don't know which one. I if I get eight or ten, I guess I get. 10. I get a ten. I'm about to say I get use my eight a ten or a twelve. Just, I definitely get a ten. I did not just use the eight that they got there to warm up. When I walked in, that dude walking out with a little double bag. I said, "Oh, yeah, man." I said, "That's the bowl." Is we having because most dude had like a. A rolling bag. Yeah, yeah. That's the one I saw. That's the one I was thinking I need. So mm-hmm. I can get a few balls. Mm-hmm. Then too, like I'd be liking it'd be I don't know. Cause you know, sometimes at the bowling now they used to have like a little pro am shop in some of them. Yeah. Yeah. Where yeah. You can like actually like get a ball made to fit mm-hmm. your thing. Yeah, mm-hmm. they ask you like how you hold the ball and if you need like a third hole for it. Like, you know, I don't put my thumb in a ball, mm-hmm. so it should be the two fingers. So they'll make a ball without the thumb hole in that mug. Mm-hmm. That's really See yeah. Now if I didn't have it Then I'd all of a sudden Want it But I don't think I need that either The third home just, Yeah Yeah I used to just keep Cause it I don't anyway. think I need it But I wouldn't I don't know yeah. mm-hmm. I'm Then I also don't know If I want to change up My, my bowling style Yeah you gotta do it Oh yeah nah once you I, got I, like the what you got right now is good. I'm about like, to say once you got your thing, you just got your thing. I'm about to say, and it's like at this point, you like really consistently bowling really good. I this will is say the most that. consistent I've ever been score wise. Yeah, nah, it's that first time that we came that we went. Oh yeah, that, that was, was a really good yeah. game. Last that was time. probably the best bowling in my life. That one. Yeah, the time that was the time before the time. That was the time before it was just me. And yeah, 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 yeah. That was crazy. That but was a really good this time. This one, though. No, this one, it could have been better. I couldn't pick up a goddamn spare to save my life. Yeah. And all the strikes that was supposed to be had. Mm. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, yeah, it, it was nah. just like, them was supposed to be strikes. It was like four strikes. in a row. Four yeah. or five in a row. And I was like, my, good. hitting it right exactly where it's supposed to hit. Yep. Mm-hmm. But I think, too, that was more so because I had that eight-pound ball. Mm-hmm. But still, but dang. But, yeah, I guess. That's why I like the heavier balls because if you you can just roll your game and it's going to hit them pins with a, a lot of force, mm-hmm. you ain't even got to throw it too hard. It's just mm-hmm. the weight of the ball is going to toss them around. Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah, That's that thing about that eight, though, man. So like I said, I like that to warm up, kind of get me mm-hmm. a little loose first. Kind of like, you know, you like in the gym. For mm-hmm. them people that like to do warm ups, yeah, before mm-hmm. they get started, yeah, I ain't gonna lie. When I be in the gym, I be unhinged. I just go into it. That, that, that's all right too. My warm up is my cardio. Yeah, that's all and right. After I do my cardio, I'm ready. I don't well, you come, yeah, 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 yeah. Man, the gym, bro. I guess everybody gave up. It's What's, back to normal. It's about that time. I'm about to say normal. it don't. It don't. Especially these days, it don't last long. These days, yeah, it was because I went there. Yesterday and was, and I was running a little late, and I was shocked because it was like empty, and I was like, mm-hmm. "What?" Mm-hmm. Now, what I do respect and like about my uh, apartment complex is apparently on the other side they have a gym as well, but it's not open, but it's supposed to be opening. And I was like, "Oh, okay, that's gonna be nice." Because now I never thought about it. Everybody got to come mm-hmm. to that. Gym now, but once the other one opened, people that actually live on that side, which is the bigger side, they can go to their gym and uh-huh. we can go to our gym and mm-hmm. hopefully that, you know, kind of limit the traffic, which it ain't that bad now to say that everybody go because mm-hmm. I feel like if you can afford to live there, you probably can afford a membership. So if you really into fitness, you probably got a gym membership somewhere because right. the gym is very <sighs> bare bones. It ain't bare bones. You can get you can get your yeet off, but. Depends yeah. on what level you ain't about yeah. to dead lift a power clean in there, but you know, yeah, yeah, yeah. we got like the, 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 the it, it, other yeah. essentials, yeah. But we don't got like a lot of too many machines. So, mm-hmm. again, if you you could make it work, but you, it ain't just like so good to where you'd be a fool not to get a membership. Like, I would understand, like, oh, yeah, I get it, uh-huh. yeah, it's good enough for me though, because I know. 
I can get creative with the machines and <laughs> emulate the, you know, like a lot of times you can, if you got free weights and other stuff, you can kind of like, you can, yeah. like, you can, you can get, get the, the range of motion. Move, move yeah. range of motion. Even if you don't have that exact yeah. machine. And compound movement. Compound yeah. movement. Yeah. Supplemental. Cause we still mm-hmm. got like the, you know, that massive thing that everybody got that got all the doohickey. Yeah. Mm-hmm. The cables and yeah, stuff. Yeah. yeah. And yeah you can make you everything. Can make, I'm about to say, yeah. you can work out your whole body. I'm about to say, you can make That's everything out of that. that. And then it, on the other side, still got like the bench slash quad. If you yeah. that kind of stuff. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. I don't traditionally, I don't barbell bench. I ain't barbell bench in a while. Oh, I only because of my wrist. I'm about to say, I barbell bench for sure. I've been just dumbbelling it out, man, but I'm about to, I've been trying to get my wrist range of motion kind of back together so I can start doing push-ups. Mm-hmm. So I just kind of like, you know, mm-hmm. get in that motion and mm-hmm. just try to get used to it. Because mm-hmm. I love to get back to doing my little bench and supersetting it with push-ups. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That's different, man. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I, I didn't even it. think about that. I never did that. Some goddamn football, Louisiana Tech football workout. Shout out to Kendall. Shout out to Kendall. And we, doing, we was doing straight football workouts, which I like because, you know. Mm-hmm. But yeah, how was the freeze for everybody? Oh yeah, the the weather. It was uh, it was cool. I mean, it wasn't enough to not have toilet paper on the on the shelves. Yeah, uh, well, you crazy. know, people gonna panic by. Yeah, but that's well, m- people out yeah. here traumatized too. So people, really yeah, panic yeah, by. yeah, people don't want to go through that. People again. really panic by by yeah. out mm-hmm. here, and you know, out there, it's we all, all we got is Walmart out there. Mm-hmm. So I went and all the lines was at the back of the store. Who? What day you went? Sunday. But I went to, I literally uh, went to go pick up some seasoning. That's it. Damn. But yeah, yeah, yeah. That's when I yeah. because I went well, I just happened to go to the store a lot last week. Me too. Because I normally only go once a week. Yeah, I went mm-hmm. twice. I went Monday, Tuesday. Yeah, me too. Friday. Yeah. yeah. And then Sunday. Yeah, me too. But it was normal where I was. I yeah. was shocked. I was like, huh. People yeah. But you know, yeah, out here, there's more there's options. More so, options. Yeah. so I was about to say out there, Walmart is like in the middle of the city. Uh-huh. And then if you don't go there, then you got to go like 20 minutes yeah. into, you know what I'm saying, McKinney. So I was oh, just like, yeah, yeah. yeah. So it was just it's different because it was like that all week. It wasn't oh, just okay, that day. Yeah, it was yeah. like that all week. But mm-hmm. I was just like, man, this is ridiculous. And I woke up the next morning. I was like. Oh, it's like I can, you know, my glass is frosted, so you can see that it's white outside. And I was like, oh, it's snow. And then I went outside, and I was like, oh, that's I'm about, it. I'm about to say the thing is though, it didn't rain because that's yeah, when, that's when it get dangerous when the roads freeze over mm-hmm. yeah. with ice. That's normally in February. Yeah. We're just getting stuff now. I was say it's, it's coming warming. now. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's and, it's, and it's a vicious cycle. It melt, freeze again, melt because yeah. it was. The weather bad weather was supposed to be Sunday or Monday. Sunday mm-hmm. night going into Monday. Monday oh yeah, because that Monday if it was eight, five four or five, it was regular outside. Uh, it had melted and everything. I was say by twelve o'clock the sun yeah. was out from say, behind the say, clouds. It wasn't no clouds I'm in the sky. 12. It was just yeah. yeah, it had melted. I was just that was when I went to work. It was me, snowing. But. It was still snowing when I yeah. went to work. When I went to work, I'm about to say the night Monday. Though. Yeah, I went to work Monday. Oh my gosh. Yeah, man. I don't. Never mind. I was about to say, people don't be celebrating MLK Day like say, that. I thought y'all were progressive. That's the one we didn't get, but we get President's Day. So, uh, Ain't that like... When is that? Ain't that like Latino Heritage Day? Wait, what is that? President's Day? It's in February. February. Oh, I February. thought that they changed. I don't even, is that even a, a federal holiday? Yeah. Yeah, it is. The banks are closed. Yeah, it is. I don't know if we get President's Day. It's, that's the one you should look over, but I guess. Yeah, I, I, How about I say I don't understand that I, one. I, I, I'll work that day. They can have that one. But no, I told her, I said I'm gonna get it back in blood. Yeah, I'm gonna get it. I, I'm getting it back yeah. in blood because I was talking to people. They was off. Okay, Monday. I talked to other people. They was like, yeah, they told us don't come into work Tuesday. Blah blah blah. Yeah. And I'm still going to work. Yeah. And then, but it's still 10 degrees. Yeah. Tuesday. It just, yeah. it was melted, but it was yeah, still cold. Yeah, it work. was still cold. No, yeah. it was still, no, don't get me wrong. It was still cold, then a mug. But the yeah. sun was out there. And I was so just like, cold. I was yeah. just like, I don't think I should be at work. Yeah. But besides, I'm not going to lie. For me personally, I got something for him. Mm-hmm. Me personally, anything between five and 40 at all feel the same. If it ain't, if it's just no cold wind, wine? yeah, I can't tell. I was about to say, no. like when I went out there and it was no. in the teens, I was like, oh, it just feel like 
Cold. It don't nah. feel cold. Cold. I'm about to say from five. Now, if it's wind, that make the difference. That's a me, factor. But but I'm about to say everything under twenty. Nah, it's all the same. It's different. No, it's not all the same. It, for me, feel wild. yeah. I'm about to say like, like the cold is. It's just cold. Cold is cold. Nah, it's cold. But, nah, nah, it's, nah, if it got some wind, that's what that's what make me wince. Like yeah. if it's cold and yeah. Yeah. but if it's just. Cold, I'd be like, it's yeah, nah. cold is cold. Nah, 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 not because when you when you like when you said when it was in the low teens, I didn't even know. I was like, oh, the sunshine. I was like, oh, okay. Yeah. Then I looked. I said, oh, it's that cold. Oh wow. I was yeah. like surprised because it didn't feel that like they cold was. is cold to me. Anything between like I said zero to forty is all the same. That's me. crazy. Yeah. Well, I will I, say I, if I, the sun is out. And, and you can get away with too. like it being, That's yeah. I'm about to say, yeah, but nah. It ain't gonna make me feel like if it's, it's 40, dark though. outside at forty degrees and it's dark outside is different than dark outside at five degrees. Yeah, nah, like, yeah, okay. Yeah, no, maybe it's just me. Yeah, no, nah, yeah, it's cold yeah. to me. I'm not acknowledging yeah. that. It ain't. I'm just telling y'all. It like, just don't. You don't feel a difference in. <laughs> you know, like how they. Like I gotta be telling y'all like sometimes when we rate stuff. Yeah, mm-hmm. something, something, something. It's all the, it's all just good. Yeah. Once I get to so, yeah. Once I get to forty, it's just all cold. I was like, say, yeah, it's yours is just like it's cold, cold, it's cool, yeah. it's warm. Yeah, it's yeah, hot. yeah, exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Yeah, exactly. But my range for cold is like it's, I said, it's, it's pretty yeah, much about yeah, zero yeah, to 40, yeah, yeah. 45. Because yeah. I definitely like, have my shiesty on. Yeah. <laughs> See, I was, That's really what I need is a shiesty. No, I have my shiesty. I, 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 I walk to work. I say, hey, I got to feel me. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah, hey. They walk in and say, oh, we get vibe. <laughs> I said, hey, man. I said, I don't play when it's cold, personally. Yeah, like I said, I, I wore the same I've been jacket I always shit. wear. Yeah. yeah I wear the when it's 40. I was in the house. Nice. It, was, it was 75 in the house. <laughs> it was the same. Like I said, I just don't, it don't feel no any different for me. Like I said, it, mm-hmm. I literally wore the same jacket I always wear. Yeah. I didn't have to. I put my long johns on. See, I ain't do nothing special. Yeah. You in the field right now, too, huh? Mm-hmm. Ooh. I say it's all cold. Now, say, no, I'm I telling just, y'all, it's I the just, wind that'll break I'm me about down. Say, I just, yeah. yeah, yeah. Like that other last week when I was like, "Oh, y'all, it's windy." Yeah, that wind'll break me down. Mm-hmm, yeah, mm-hmm, mm-hmm, but mm-hmm. just regular cold. Yeah. See, I disagree. See, uh, <laughs> bro, <laughs> when it's five, bro, you gonna feel five, bro. But we don't feel five. But, when we went to Colorado. And yeah, stuff. it didn't feel. Colorado was different. We though. had layers on. Nah, bro. I I tell people this all the time, How about bro. Say? Colorado wasn't as cold as I thought it was. No, it wasn't. Be. See, because it's cold. I say cold is cold at the certain temperature. Yeah, I'm nah. proving my point. Cold mm. is cold at the certain. No, I no, disagree. Because with that, out it's there, the wind. I disagree with that. When we was in, when we was in Colorado, and we went into the mountains, it was cold. It was like cold, cold, like negative degrees. See, when we got into the city, nah, it, wasn't it wasn't like cold. that. It wasn't, it wasn't even snowing. It wasn't even cold in the city. Yeah, it wasn't cold. Like when we got out there, I had like layers on, and then by the time we got home, I was like in a thin yeah, jacket. Yeah, yeah, like, that's yeah. That's what I'm saying. It like was, we it was like more humid than when anything. We were sitting outside. Yeah. yeah, I was cool. Yeah, but I like now this wasn't the same when we was, when we was in the mountains. Yeah, yeah, like it was different than yeah, that. Yeah, it was way different than that because it was like humid out there too. It was humid. It was very humid. But no, but. <laughs> <laughs> regardless, that was so y'all proving my point. Yeah, but. Cold is cold because it be it was five four when you get in the mountains. Man, cold. no, man, I man, man, but look, <laughs> I'm saying this. I would, I wasn't trying to make that a point, but I'm saying this. So the the freeze was cool. I'm glad our power did go off here Sunday Sunday night. Like for like maybe like forty minutes. Oh my, that's goodness. crazy. Our Overnight. power didn't even go out, and Overnight. our power go out for anything. Remember, what I put in the, in the chat. Yeah, like, anybody else power go out? Yeah, oh, shit. I shit went out for like forty minutes, but because oh, wow. it woke me up, it was overnight. right. Yeah, I woke up. Look, I woke up, and I like, I was like, I know this sound. Yeah, the sound of, no of sound. nothing. Yeah, like no nothing. You can running. hear that mug just. Zhoo. I didn't hear that. That's just, what like no, that's I, what always hey, wake me up. Hey, I just heard this. Yeah, I said, oh, I don't even hear. I yeah, said, I woke up. I looked up at the roof. I was like, "My power out." Yeah, as a brother that had his power out, yeah. I said, you know, "My power." I know what that sounds. Like. You know that feeling. I look, <laughs> it's I, a feeling. I said, "I said, I know that feeling." Yeah, <laughs> it ain't always been cold either. Yeah. Ah, but, anyway. <laughs> <laughs> but anyway, but he came back on. Uh, I kind of went back to sleep. I like it to come back on. Yeah, then it went off again, like for like a minute when I was getting ready for work. Mm-hmm. That was. 
That was Friday. No. That, that the was power Friday. went out? That was Sunday. Okay. Because yeah. the weather was supposed to be bad Monday. Yeah. yeah. Monday. Did y'all have so a, you woke up and got ready for work on Monday. Monday. Did they at least give y'all a be by y'all phone, we may cancel work because yeah. of the weather? No. Oh, really. shit. None of that. But then they went cut thought about it. But because when we got to work, didn't nobody do nothing. Yeah. I said, you got to know I ain't doing shit. <laughs> hey. Change the windows. Yeah. Listen to uh, first tape. Yeah. Type a little stuff up. See, so, because it's one of those things like everybody else off. You're starting yeah. to get you a sound routine. Yeah, I do first take. I do sports shows. That's what I do. I go first take. I go Colin Cowherd. I know me and Miko, the only one that like him. Then I go first things first. And then after that, I just go with my playlist on YouTube. That's what I do. And it's slow jams. Like yeah. uh, Alexander O'Neill, yeah. SOS Band. Yeah. I throw a little King George in there. That's my. On Fridays, I turn up, though. Yeah. Fridays, that's when I go to my trap playlist. And yeah. I raise that disc, stand yeah. up. <laughs> How's that been treating you, that stand up disc? I like it. It's keeping me active. That's good. And, I, and, and I'm a, I got an office, right? I know I keep saying this, but I walk around when I talk because yeah. I got the AirPods. So I'm not on the phone. phone. Yeah. So I'd be like, had the AirPods in, the music be playing. I'd be talking like, hey, man, we can't do it for 300. It got to be 450. Oh, that feel different. Oh, it got, it got to be 450. That feel different. And I'm walking around the office. I just want to walk by your office and just to see you. Oh, yeah. I'd be it, just to see you in action on the phone. Oh, I'd, be, I'd be active. I'd be active. I'd be very active. I would Polite, like but active. But, I would yeah. like that. Yeah. I don't. Our desks are like old school, massive wooden nah. all in one that got cabinets, yeah. so you can't just. Yeah, did I mean, have, I guess they could put it on top of the desk, and but eh. oh, yeah, did you? Got to, didn't mm-hmm. didn't you say? Uh, did you ever figure out if they had them? Didn't you say? Yeah, some people. Have, I, I, if I wanted one, they would give me. Yeah, one, yeah. or they make it work. But yeah, for I'm sure. Like, yeah. yeah, I like to. I just get up and you know I drink. Too much water at work, so I'm <laughs> yeah. always up for one reason or another. Either yeah, I'm yeah. out of water or in mm-hmm. going to the restroom. Yeah, I've yeah. been doing. I just got through doing field work, so like it's. I got to get back used to being in the office because in the field you really ain't. You can't do nothing but work. Yeah, yeah. but they make time go by super fast. I love mm-hmm. it. Like I my nine to because I used to be out by nine and come back around two two thirty. So that time would go by super fast. Now I'm like, God, dog, shoot. It's 11? I'm not used to seeing yeah. like Because I normally get so deep into work, I don't see the times of 11 and 12. Mm-hmm. But now I'm like, dang, it's 11? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. 12? Oh, mm-hmm. sure. Can I get to one? Yeah. That's yeah. how I be. Like, I was like, oh, it's different. I got to, I got to, well, I know it's way a bit of, way more of an acclamation than you because you was well, no, on the road yeah. all day. Yeah, yeah. Well, but also, I still got, I still got free range at this job. Yeah, I can yeah. move around. Like the last two days, I've been moving around, and I realized that's such a critical p- a component to what I do for work. Yeah, because for the last since 2016, yeah, I've been moving around. Yeah, so you know yeah, what I mean? It's hard to have a stationary job, but it's good for me because I I literally was texting somebody this week, and Wednesday when I started moving around because usually I used to first have it a week Monday Tuesday that's like office calling estimates. Vendors, mm-hmm. homeowners, customers. Yeah. Then Wednesday when I started like. Moving around. Oh, I'm gonna go see this myself. I'm gonna yeah. go blah 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 blah. And uh she was like, You moving around today? And I was like, Yeah. And uh I was like, Man, I go a little stir crazy if I gotta be in there consecutively. Yeah. The 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 fact that I can move around alleviates it. Now if I was yeah. just confined to that, yeah, I'll go crazy. Cause yeah. ADHD it's, and stuff. Yeah. But um but anyways, from the freeze came all the issues. Mm-hmm. People pipes bursting. Yeah. House is flooding, and you know I'm in charge of all that. So Jobs galore, man, boy. I was. Can you go out today? You know, and, and yeah. everybody want their stuff done today. You know, oh what yeah, I mean? everybody want it done yeah. today, like right now. People yeah. don't want to be uncomfortable Mm-mm. at all, and it's never an issue to us an issue. You know, yeah. Mm-hmm. And they call you, man, my heater down. Like one house I had, it's like the upstairs heater working. Yeah, the downstairs heater not working. Yeah. Mm. Like, oh, and okay. heat already rise. Yeah. So, and yeah. I was like, okay. Yeah. Still. But you, you have to understand, we got to go out there. Yeah. And in my in my industry, because I juggle a lot of industries. Yeah. And I was just like, hey, man, they got to go to a diagnosis first. Yeah. Diagnosis is first. Like, don't nothing happen without that. Yeah. Diagnose. Then what happens after And that? hope they have the parts. Yeah. And get yeah. them quick. And usually, so, usually, like, so if you got an issue, 
people are charged like a one fifty service fee, right? A plumber, HVAC person. Yeah. Say your stuff went out. Okay, we can get somebody out there for one twenty five or whatever for a service call, yeah. which is diagnosis. If what they going up, if what they find out is the issue and it's cheap, they mm-hmm. just do it. They just do it because that's part of the service fee. Yeah. It's when it's something else. Yeah. Like the bigger stuff. Like oh no. Mm-hmm. Yeah. This nigga need this, 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 this. this. Yeah. Like, oh, okay. Now I got to call you at the home and say, hey, Mr. Earlton. No, you thought it was just this. Yeah. But it's this. Yeah. I need to talk to people with, with everybody mm-hmm. in with trades. Because every trade, per, every person I talk to that got a trade, mm-hmm. they always make it seem like another trade is the, the greener pasture. Mm-hmm. They all green. But it's never consistent. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. if you talk to somebody to do HVAC, they be like, man, I ain't going to lie. You should be a yeah, plumber. Yeah, I don't yeah. get in that act, man. You know, having to get up in that attic, man. That's, yeah. that's different than talk to somebody that's a plumber. I mean, getting up under there. Now, mm-hmm. me personally, the type of claustrophobic I I I I have, I don't want to get up under nothing in a tight space. Electrician. And something run across my body, bro. Like you in the house. Bro, mm. I'm not Screw doing this, that. It I, 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 I don't know why. I think I run the HVAC because I just know how much HVAC is no matter what. Like, you ain't about to just get nothing, and nothing done cheap. for 100, 200. I'm about to say it's 10,000 yeah, for a say, brand That's new. why I'm always yeah. enticed by the, the HVAC. Well, and that's why I said HVAC diagnosis because I seen somebody out there which was like 125. Yeah. That's just diagnosis. That's, that's just to see it. Yeah, and then, it. so the other, the what he needs to do is 495. Yeah. And like, that's on the light end. You happy if you only had to spend that much. Yeah. yeah. So don't let your summer. unit go out. I'm about to say your unit go summer, out, you, bro. You, bought, you buying a, a used mm-hmm. car. And it's a lot yeah. of hard conversation with homeowners because, yeah. you know, some home, homeowners don't want to rent winterize their house. Yeah. Some homeowners have an old house. Yeah. You had a house built in the 60s, bro. You need to go and that do a lot of different stuff. From the router yeah. to, to the, the tutor. tutor. Yeah. Like your piping is just bad. Yeah, like you yeah. know, I don't care. Hey, I don't care. Yeah, I don't care, being, yeah, I don't care how much paint you put on your house. Yeah, the piping still old. Nah, them the houses I for sure ain't about to get under. Oh, it's yeah, easy nah. for animals to live under there. Heck, I'm about to bro, say something run across my leg. It be dark. families of animals. Oh, I'm about to say you shine that light, life. you just see all them eyes. Yeah, you and got you cats on this side, possums on this side, rats, and then something crazy. You see something you can't. Brush yeah. out. You gotta like. I'm say you hit your head up under that thing. You just sleep. <laughs> you hit your head. Heck fall asleep no, in that thing. Now you did it. Yeah. Now you did it. I'm not doing it, bro. I, I can't. No. Yeah. I can't get up under. I'll get in the roof, bro. And I and think I'd be more of a carpenter. I've always been into woodwork. No. But um. So we we had a, we had to put out a lot of fires this week. Yeah. But it made me feel good because I enjoy problem solving. You yeah. know what I mean? They caught me with an issue. You know, I figure out how to fix it. We get yeah. it done. Um, so that's kind of been the week. Yeah. It's, been, it's been pretty busy, man. Pretty busy because, you know, natural. It ain't yeah. a disaster, but natural occurrences. Yeah. It it raises the, you know, yeah. emotions and alertness and, you know, things like that. But luckily, I'm a good conflict re- resolution person. Yeah. I'm a, I'm a disarmer. You know what yeah. I mean? I can like, hey, man, hey, 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 hey. Yeah. hey. It's like, no, I understand what uh, you're yeah, what going on. And, no, hey, but I feel you, bro. Yeah. When I hit the I feel you bro, yeah. cause I don't really say bro on the recording line. Yeah. Now you call this phone. Yeah. I wanna talk to you a different way than when you call me on this phone. Yeah. Mm-hmm. You know what yeah. I'm saying? That yeah. recording line is, yes yeah. sir, yeah, you good. You yeah. Know, I'm sorry for the blah 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 blah. You call yeah. the phone. Hey bro. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie, your stuff kinda out of that, bro. I ain't yeah. gonna lie. Now hey, I can save you a little money. Yeah. But I can't save you all your money. You yeah. know what I'm saying? But anyways, that was that was my week. Yeah. Know? Out of that uh, and moving around has been good because it won. It was nice today. Yeah, yeah it, was. it was lovely today. Actually. Yeah, it was and beautiful. My window and was it was done. like fifty five. I'm about to say 57. the sun. Let's see, the sun been out all week for me, so it's been mm-hmm. giving me a false sense of warmth because I don't get out my car either. So it's like, yeah, I'm only <laughs> feeling the sun as I drive around. Yeah, so I was like, oh, but again, another reason why I I didn't even notice it was in the teens. Now if I say, see. I wouldn't go get because I wouldn't. I wouldn't. I, I wouldn't would, face the elements. I'm about to say I wouldn't go be that. I up. was just walking to like, yeah. it. I wouldn't go be that the up. Car in the office. I'm about to say I wouldn't go be that up. I was sitting in it for hours. I'm about to say I wouldn't go be that up. Yeah, maybe it'd be <laughs> different. If maybe, you was I in that, know. if you was in that, you'll feel it. Yeah. But, but anyways, uh, but but no, regardless, it's just you know, stand uh, level headed. You know, 
January yeah. going by fast, man. It is it's very fast. Very last fast. week is the last. I mean, next week is the last full week mm-hmm. of January. Next week, mm-hmm. yeah. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Which is funny because I feel like I don't know how it is for everybody. I feel like January went by fast, but I feel like after next week, everything is going to pick up. Like I can see everything picking up in these next few weeks. Like whenever I look at my calendar at work, like mm-hmm. right now, I probably have like three or four meetings like the outside my regular meetings on the calendar in the next couple of weeks i got like 10 meetings mm. 10 11 meetings and i'm like man it's it's really about to pick up and mm-hmm. you kind of gotta like prepare yourself for that because man i if this if this month went by fast february gonna go by fast because it's 28 it's pretty oh, short. 29 days it's, it's the next month uh-huh. it's a pretty short month in yeah. yeah yeah that's some big fights happening in february yeah we do i forgot about that you know, we do. We do. But yeah, man. Um, well, we had what fifty one. Mm-hmm. We had a topic. Yeah, we always do have a topic. Yeah. Well, we had a topic. We never get, get to this morality. Yeah, <laughs> I mean, it's gonna be a really good one. Yeah, yeah that yeah, means yeah, yeah. Because yeah, I think we'll just start with it. Yeah, but just, I think I feel like the freeze though to get back to it. It's pretty anticlimactic. Like I prepared. Yeah, it was. Yeah, it was. Yeah. Like, yeah, it was. I was yeah, dripping was. faucets and, then, and covering pipes and yeah, like yeah, all type of stuff and. I woke up and I was like, oh, this is it? The electricity literally flickered. Like, it okay. flickered. Like, yeah. And I was like, oh. Yeah. Like, it was in like yeah, seconds and then that was it. And yeah. I was just chilling. Mm-hmm. Like, you know, it was playoff football. So I really was just I forgot to yeah. bring relaxing, that up, yeah. enjoying that. I forgot to bring that up. Yeah. And yeah. then the way it was structured, we got games Saturday, Sunday, and Monday. Monday. So that's, yeah. I, I was just, chilling. I got in trouble Sunday. I'll tell y'all off, Mike. I yeah. was just, I was just relaxing, <laughs> enjoying football, man. Yeah. yeah. It wasn't, it wasn't One too bad. Part, like, is it, you know, Ooh. I didn't win any Wait, you ain't say that. Game, I made but. that gumbo. And I was like, oh, I'm set for the whole. I'm about to say, that was the thing, too. I made chili whenever that was, and I've been, I ate on that till Wednesday. Mm-hmm. Oh, that was yesterday. <laughs> yeah, I'm about to say, yeah. <laughs> I'm about to say, I got some frozen gumbo in the freezer right now. I was so. about to say, yeah, I flashed out. I ate yeah. that. I've been eating that since Wednesday, uh, since whenever, Saturday. Yeah. yeah. I think I made it Saturday. Yeah. Because I bought my stuff to make my gumbo, too. So I guess I'll make that. That's why this I sent you the video, because I thought you was making it, too. Yeah. But I did make my roux out of can. I didn't I didn't make my. I'm a can? What? Not you. A yeah. can? Not, Not a can. It's, a, it's, it's in there. I saw it. A little Louisiana? They didn't have it at HEB. Raging Cajun. Hmm. Interesting. I'm not, I'm not familiar. I'm a do gay man, but you know, they didn't have it. it they was I'm out a Zatarans. I'm going to say that sounds familiar. Raging Cajun. Mm-hmm, I like yeah. the Zatarans one that make a good one. That's a that's in a box. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that was, it was in a box. Not y'all banging on Rue. That's him over there. <laughs> I'm so condescending. A, but I'm you not. see, I didn't take the bait. I just, <laughs> no. I was like, nah, I'm going to let you just show your hand. I didn't show my hand. I just <laughs> no, I, I told her you started laughing. I was like, yeah. So no. you, you meant that that way. No, you can't, can't no, I up, did. no, I did. No, I did. Because I ain't taking it. I was in the box. I stayed no, with a straight did. face. No, and then he just started no, laughing. No, I was like, see? No, 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 no. There you go. No, we want this. Listeners. No, bro. They know, man. Listeners. We we want this. No, bro. We want this. That was nasty work, dog. That was nasty. I ain't assume or nothing. I was like, okay. If he ain't going to. I was like, okay. We'll see. That boy say, that boy say, oh, that's the one in the box. <laughs> that's, that's crazy. That's nasty work, bro. I wouldn't be a malicious, bro. Nah, it, it, ain't, it ain't like it's it's some wild frozen one that come with the meat and everything yeah. too. Bo, it's, like, it's just the roof. It's the, bo, just the every base. time gumbo come up, I still gotta do everything else. Bo. <laughs> Well, I mean, it ain't too much. To you you a period to be honest? No, no, because I didn't make mine from scratch, so I'm, I'm, all, I'm already admitted. But, but that you I, see, but it's, it's, it's showing. I'm about to say, it's yo, showing. it's showing. Yeah, it's bro, showing. it's yeah. It's okay. You showed your cards, bro. It's okay because even even though you did it as a kid, you was like, oh, you did yours in a box though. Ain't nothing it's, wrong for it's, Ain't nothing wrong it's with like the it's box. different. It's different because he his, his, he got his out of box. Ain't nothing wrong with the box. I just know Zadam had stuff coming to box. I was trying to make it up. Man, it's been a so little bit. stuff coming to box. Man, spent a little bit more time stirring. He's just automatically better. Oh man. 
One day, you know what I like to do? Both of us to make ours yeah, and, and, and a blind test and say which one tastes like the roux from scratch. Okay. Because I've had scrap from scratch roux and it just don't taste no different. To me. It is a million dollar cook off. Okay. Now maybe the people that's intense that come with their own seafood stock that they know oh no themselves. see I don't do all that. Now that may make the flavor different, but just you know get that thing. We can just do mix it. it. We can definitely. I don't do taste that. no difference, man. We can do that. We now can. I you know don't I put am that way. Fish in and I don't taste it. No, now, no, I am that way with search stuff where it's like, mm-hmm. I, I, you give me some instant potatoes and you. Oh, yeah. So nah, yeah, 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 yeah nah, I can yeah. taste the difference. Nah, that's against the grain. Yeah, no. Nah, if you give me, yeah, no. Nah, <laughs> but like yeah, certain yeah. stuff, I don't mind taking the shortcut sometimes. There ain't nothing wrong with that, bro. When it comes to certain things. The reason but, why I did it out the can, I really literally said I'm going to do it out the can because I don't feel like stirring. Too see, cold, told you. <laughs> Just stir. <laughs> I gotta, uh, <laughs> not this weekend. I feel like I'm gonna start cooking, like, like trying to cook, maybe find something that I want to cook every week. Cause I need to, like, start, you do that. I need to start Plus, cooking new stuff. I know that, my, yeah. you know, regular, I can do this, but I want to start, like, kind of experimenting a little bit mm-hmm. in the kitchen. I think I'm gonna do that, like, every weekend, just go get some stuff. I'm like, oh, I'm gonna try to, I'll try to make this. Mm-hmm. You know? mm-hmm. Cause it's I need good. to, I need to perfect some stuff. Yeah. I told y'all my, Mac and cheese. I need to make one before the month over with in January towards the end. But, you know, playoff football. But, you know, as we get Super Bowl party? As we get further down, of course. Mm -hmm. As we get further down, though, you know, it don't be as many games. So, it is time consuming. But this... That's the thing I like. I love the beginning of playoffs because when it's so many games. It's mm-hmm. nice. It's a good I man. like it when it's a lot of games. Man, Sunday was like so fulfilling. Because we about to get to the point where you're only going to get one a day. Mm-hmm. Then you're just going to get one. And mm-hmm. that's it. Definitely you know it's over. Because we only got this weekend. Divisional, championship. I must have then after this weekend, I, like I say, you're going to get to the point where you only got two games. Because mm-hmm. mm-hmm. we got four right now. Mm-hmm. Then you're going to have two. Then you're mm-hmm. just going to have one. Mm-hmm. That's why I know people like the end, but I like getting there because that's when you get the most. Like we had, yeah. so that mean we had eight games. Oh no, because I buy it was still four games. No, it was six, six games. Six games. Six games I was two just like, yeah. And but, uh, and the game got flicks, so that's why Monday night had a double header instead of just one game, which I enjoyed. I, enjoyed I was at home doing nothing. So man, I wasn't doing. I like. <clears throat> I'm like really it. happy for the Texans. I, yeah, I, for they've sure. been my favorite team to watch all year. Sure. I'm telling y'all, I just got a feeling. They gonna beat the Ravens. Uh, I think so. It's not as easy as I think yeah, so. it's not I've been thinking that too. It's not as easy. And Marlon Humphrey out yeah. too. I just it's just everything up. gotta just fall in like everything gotta be perfect for them to beat them. But it's, it's just something about when you young and mm-hmm. you free. You like mm-hmm. they ain't got nothing. Bro, CJ Stroud is a rookie, mm-hmm. rookie head coach. The team, bro, they ain't got the pressure. The that team the is new. They ain't got the pressure that the Ravens got who is Oh, Lamar Jackson about to be a two-time MVP. He done got paid. Now he need to prove why they he need he a got Super paid. Bowl. Yeah. He need a like, Super Bowl. Yeah. And then they got a lot of dudes on their team and expiring contracts. So now they want to – It's it's. And I they, feel like the too much might pressure create on too them. much tightness. And yeah. then, too, they ain't played – because they even played the last week. So they really ain't played in, like, Three almost weeks. a month. Yeah, yeah. Well, yeah, month, yeah, Coming off a team that's still in rhythm because they just played. Yeah. Mm-hmm. They make it tough, man. And then, hey, I ain't going to lie to you, man. You get past that Browns defense – the Ravens defense good, but that that Browns defense is really good. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you get through that and make it easy work. Mm-hmm. And, so, it's hey, a, that, and it's a lot of like that Ravens defense ain't gonna just be the hardest thing in the world for you. Mm-hmm. Like you said, the Ravens got a lot of players and like they need this. Yeah, yeah. It ain't saying. too many people on their team that got a ring I'm about anyway. To say, I'm about to say, and the only different. one is no Odell. Odell. Odell yeah. I was about to say he don't. Well, well maybe so. No. It's probably a couple probably of linemen. Probably on the do. defense or linemen, yeah. yeah. But then, I'm telling you, bro, you just play with a certain freedom when you know you ain't supposed to be there no way, so it don't really matter, bro. Yeah. And when you just can play loose. Yeah. You, you done witness it in West Orange where it's like that expectation of championship. Yeah. Say championship, so you just, you just tight. naturally yeah. get a little tight. Bro, they ain't got that. Every touchdown, bro. Like, the, oh, the, we the Texans have yeah. already over exceeded expectations. Getting in the play. Oh, yeah. Them getting to where they at right now is kind of like uh, he can lose it's, and be like, oh, money, no, I had a great year. It literally don't matter, bro. Yeah. Like, it don't matter if they like – if they – people singing their praises regardless. They don't yeah. have to win. And they best receivers hurt. Yeah, yeah. they yeah. hell out. So yeah. It's like, yeah. yeah so. That's Nico Collins out there looking like that. So it's Tell like – he been 
Oh my it god, bro, crazy. he's been going crazy. That's what I'm saying, bro. It don't matter. I felt bad when they like, they went like down. up there, like we yeah. ready. Mm-hmm. See what happens. Yeah, I'm Ravens. Ready. Don't talk to me like I'm telling yeah. you. That's the difference. We're not letting this happen. That's yeah. what I'll say, bro. I just, I just got a feeling. Yeah. CJ Stroud, a bad yeah. boy. He don't turn the ball over that much either. He don't. He protects the ball. In the beginning, I, I feel like in the beginning of the year, it was like four games before he actually like had like a turnover turnover. Yeah, yeah. He, he, went, a he went a long time because yeah, I think he broke the record for the, uh, I, the uh, Texans. I, I think he did. I think he threw. In the game, he threw it and he threw two. But yeah, yeah. That, yeah, yeah. He, that's why I said. Yeah. Bro. He's, bro, he's like, that's my favorite team. That's been my favorite team to watch. He's like, he's just smooth, bro. I hate, like, I he hate just, that they, I hate that they got to play the Ravens, man, because I, I wanted to root for them. Just the Ravens? Well, no, I wanted to root for the Texans because it's such a feel-good story, yeah. but I really, really, really root. Really, really rooting for the Ravens, so I'm like, ah, y'all gotta play each other already. Yeah. This is the first postseason as a Chiefs fan that I am okay if we lose because I'm ready to root for the Texans. I say y'all in one. Thing. I'm ready to root for the Texans. Yeah. I, just, I just feel like Patrick. But I would Holmes, love to play them. He, he, he Tom Brady. You just can't count him out till it's over. Like, and then the Bills been so up and down. I just you just never know which one you are gonna get. Yeah. yeah. Cause yeah. and then you know they it, if Allen throw picks, this I'm about to say it yeah. lit. But then y'all defense good too. Like, I know they actually good this year. So that's why I'm. They like, might actually get a turnover. Yeah. Like, oh shit. And I'm about to say, and if y'all made Tyreek Hill look like that, like Stephon Diggs. Yeah. I, I ain't really. Worried and then about. they got they little weird thing going on where they don't really throw him the ball like that. Dave Davis, the number he was one getting shit. like 13 targets. Now he getting like six, seven. Because they know. So he that's leaving. why I'm like, yeah, they know he leaving. I think it, but y'all are gonna, I gotta go Buffalo. But y'all used to playing in the cold, so yeah, that don't really, that don't really mean. And I mean, and y'all can run the ball a little bit now. You can, you know, Pacheco, Old Pacheco. But uh, it's gonna be a good. I'm gonna be hyped up for that. That's yeah. Sunday because that's you know people try to say the Bengals are our rival. People try to say the Texas tried to bubble up before Mister Nasty Man was nasty. Mm-hmm. But the Bills are our real rival. That's our rival. Yeah, and we are their rival. The only difference is in a rivalry, both people got to win. Yeah. So it's not really a rivalry because yeah, we can win. Yeah. But then that, if they win this, I'm going to be happy for them. Like, oh, they got one. Yeah. But if they lose, I'm going to just be like. But you know, people can put an asterisk next to that overtime game. Wow. He didn't get a chance to. You know, that's they literally changed the rules after that. It's not our fault. Oh, no, it's not. But, you know. That's out the box, too. But anyway. <laughs> No, I'm just <laughs> that's no, they, crazy. They, they savoring that one for the. Uh, that's I think they the, might. That's I'm, the Sunday night game because that's that's the one people really gonna be like. Because I, I feel like if there was any time they would beat us, it'd be now. They got everything in their favor. Oh yeah, and then the, the they got everything. in their I, I like the mm-hmm. lines. I, I just they just I just like them. What the they lines, built. Yeah, yeah. I like and the lines. with the coach and then Jared Goff, they sent him there to just waste away, and he didn't. Rejuvenated it the, himself. The team. I like that because they are a franchise that picked themselves off the ground. Yeah, they were yeah, bad. For they was like, I used to hate when they used to they, play for things. During things, I'm like, why do we get a line? Like nobody. This is a waste of bro. like TV. It's slide. trash, bro. And that was years. I thought that. So hey, I'm happy. Standing outside the line, playing on. And yeah. they should beat the Bucks. Yeah, they should beat the Bucks. That was a. Uh, uh, that was more about what Philly wasn't than, yeah, what, the Bucks than were. what the Bucks were. I yeah, mean, Baker sure. was cool. But for sure, for sure. I, I think that's that's it. I, I got the I got the lines. Y'all game. Uh, it's all. It's, it just depends on which which team show up. Because because Mahomes can show up and throw for four hundred. He can be a sputtering. Well, I think, I'm kind of like getting off of my home. He the face the consistency. It's 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 uh, what's his face with the Bills? Josh Allen. He the one that's the most inconsistent. Yeah, that's like true. you don't know what you're gonna get. So yeah, yeah you might get a that could go machine, either way. Yeah, you might get in drone my, as a now. Nah, I will say this though. <laughs> I've been right all year. In my mind, it's gonna be a high scoring game, which means it's gonna be a low scoring game. Okay. Anytime I think it's gonna be a shootout, it never be a shootout. Mm-hmm. And I, in my mind, it should be a shootout. Best gunslingers, arguably in the NFL. I wouldn't. I wouldn't be surprised if the final score is like <laughs> three zero. Time. Yeah, like nine three. You know mm-hmm. what I mean? Some low, nasty, Twelve low, six. Yeah. You know in my I'm, mind, you're gonna have to score thirty to win, so it's mm-hmm. gonna be a low scoring game. And you know, you know, in that snow, that cold, cold where the field goes hard to come by. Oh, it's yeah. so funny. I think everybody oh, yeah. just assuming that the the forty nine is gonna beat the Packers. Packers. Like no, but I literally like at least the. Texans game is interesting just because how good CJ Straw been playing and late. They got some pieces, bro. Mm-hmm. But the uh, 
Packers, they done over it. They weren't supposed to beat the Cowboys, so now everybody. Because even the head coach of the 49ers was like, he's we was prepping for the Cowboys then. Second quarter, they just Yeah, he's like, it. yeah, we mm-hmm. stopped. Cause <laughs> and I was like, I yeah, saw that's that. I saw that. I saw that. But yeah, the Packers, they already overachieved too. But they just really not that good, so I don't see them mm-hmm. getting past the 49ers. <laughs> the Cowboys, man, they need to do a whole like – that was insane. They need a clean house, bro. Mm-hmm. I ain't mm-hmm. gonna lie. And they didn't do anything. Nothing. McCarthy still there. Well, Dan Quinn, if he leave, it's gonna be on his own attrition because he got some head coaching jobs. Mm-hmm. Bill Belichick, congrats on the Atlanta job. He got that. No, but he got a second interview this weekend. And it's, Bill Belichick want to be in. <laughs> well, he said that's he what wanted, I was thinking. I he wanted an underachieving team with talent. That was literally what his words was. Uh, then he won't ATL then. Yeah. Never oh. mind. Yeah. When then they young too, because if you go to the, the Chargers, all them players like older or veterans outside yeah. of Justin Herbert. So well, that, that's true because he can mold that defense. And then you know he love a good tight end too. He got Kyle Pitts there. They need mm-hmm. a they need a, a quarterback because Ritter ain't the answer. But they got Drake London too, and I'm they got uh, Belichick there. He can they gonna get him a quarterback. The quarterback whisper Ooh. that's been shown. No, he need. No, I'm not saying he the quarterback whisper. I'm saying that oh, he if he get whisper. there, he gonna no, he, he gonna be able to get a quarterback. That's what I was about to say. He's not, or the they gonna get him one. He's not the quarterback whisper, whisperer, but he's a defensive mastermind. Now you go to the Chargers. All them boys are already playing how they gonna play. Yeah, I'm because yeah, they old. They said in their ways. But them uh, them ATL. Yeah, he can yeah. mold. They can yeah. mold them. He can yeah. mold them, which is probably more attractive. Like yeah, for him. Shoot, how he look going there telling Khalil Mack, Joey Bosa to do something? They like shit. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna say Keenan Allen. That's why I said they. I'm a save time all I'm pro. Say man, they ain't gotta change. They like, you know, yeah. they like all on they like big money contracts. Mm-hmm. So they you just kind of need to get somebody that can go in there and mm-hmm. refund a little bit it like Jim Harbaugh. That man say he ain't. You know, normally they like kind of try to keep it discreet under wraps. He straight up started taking his interviews for an NFL was, job. They like, say he going to San Diego. I mean, I said L.A. Yeah, <laughs> I was like, so he, he got his interview. He looking at real estate. I was like, oh, yeah. well, okay then. So, Congratulations. Ain't nobody going to Las Vegas though, huh? No. See what I be talking about? No, Wait, did they even? Y'all need oh, to get well, that, y'all, need, they, y'all, need, y'all need to get that man a job. I'm about to say because that should be locked in. You it's really want, insulting that he don't want him as the head coach. Antonio Pierce, bro, I don't. He just need, at this point. He just need an I just, coordinator with him. I was about and to a say, quarterback. And a quarterback. yeah. That goes well, we it. obviously don't treat quarterbacks. Either, <laughs> but they really, I they we don't treat nobody. Did their card dirty. Yeah. No. Well, they. That's why they got. Uh, uh, what's his name? But because he's the quarterback team. coach, and he just sold that though. Josh McDaniels. No. Uh. uh about Gruden. 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 Yeah. You know he's the quarterback coach, and so. The what second third year that Carr was there, that's when they got him. Mm-hmm. But they got him like to like kind of mold that and then kind of bring the team together. Because apparently, when he was a coach, that's what that was his thing. He would come in, clean house, and then start over and then like build a championship. Just team. before that, it was he was with Tampa Bay when they won that championship. Yeah, but people, yeah. that was a long time. But ago. it was a very long I wish, time ago. I wish I wish uh, Jazz was here because a lot of people say he inherits that team from Tony Dungy. That was Tony Dungy's team that he put together. The Tampa, yeah, Tampa yeah. Bay, and then he got that team. Yeah, and that's what took him. Yeah, but we'll see. We'll see. It should be interesting. Like I said, I just, oh, man. I don't feel good about the Ravens game as a man that's rooting for the Ravens because I ain't like how they did Lamar Jackson during the off season, man. Mm-hmm. Like, ain't nobody send him off for qualifying off. He just won the MVP. Well. He's going to win the MVP. He's going to win the MVP. Mm-hmm. And he couldn't get – that's, man, yeah, you yeah. can't tell me that ain't about yeah. color, man. You think he Lamar ever leave Baltimore? Yeah. Yeah. Well, it's not a sports podcast. I just throwing it out there. Oh, yeah. I was going to say, I, and you well, know. How about to say he lost My sports in, takes bro. don't be taken seriously most of the time anyway. If Baltimore goes – Because I'm going to say, if I would he, they just him. locked him in for five years. I'm about to say, I would, I, I, if we lose, I would be rooting for the Ravens. But I'm going to say, they move as he moved too. So, it had to – some stuff would have to happen. Maybe if he still can't win some – get deep into the playoffs. They got to make it to at least the division champ, which means they just got to win one game because mm-hmm. yeah. they already got to buy. So, they got to yeah. win. If to they th- win and then lose, it's okay. Yeah. Because they're going to they gonna have to play either the Chiefs or the Bills. And That's not an easy out either I'm about way. to say, you ain't going to be mad if you yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. you lose the one of them. It's kind of like, yeah. It's like, yeah. man, yeah. 
Now you lose to the Texans. If, like, I'm about to say if he yeah, loses to, lose to the Texans, it's that's on the no rookie going. quarterback. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. But ain't nobody gonna say nothing if you lead to Patrick Mahomes. Yeah, no, nah, no, nah, no. Nah. That's just gonna that's be only the that's just gonna be a classic game. It's gonna make sense. It's just like, gonna be a classic people game. People can make that it's just make gonna sense. speak more to Patrick Mahomes' greatness. They ain't nobody gonna really say. Yeah, that yeah, that's true. Yeah. They ain't gonna say what he didn't do. They gonna say what. Yeah. yeah and also too, sometimes too, I be feeling like. You be forgetting like them people play off. They on offense. They can't stop the other person. So I know, yeah, that's what I be saying. So like if the defense ain't playing bad, if the defense playing bad, but he played good, then still it'd probably be like, oh well, yeah, yeah. But he gonna have to put up some points against the Texans because they gonna let that thing. You know how they've been starting off the game, big play. First, first play, I'm tossing that mug 60 yards. <laughs> we gonna, why, hey, we're going to see what we got yeah. instantly. That's why I like young coaches. Yeah. Just test your chin instantly. Hey, they come in a, hey, and unorthodox. Fire yeah. it up. Fire it up. What we they, got to lose. I was about to say, they play like I play basketball. As soon yeah. as you get in, shoot that mug. Bro, yeah. That would probably be my motto if I was the Texan. What we got to lose. We done already exceeded exactly expectations. Strategy, we man. happy already. Yeah. See what they do, and then we'll go. And then adjust play. from there. We'll go yeah. and play. That first pass complete. Oh, oh. Uh, yeah, we here. That's who. Hey, we got who some. Was that that we wasn't got some. last week. That was the week before last, where that very first play. No, so they was, did that two weeks in a row. They did that against they the, did Browns. That the Browns. The Browns. I didn't. I didn't. But see that I don't game. think they Browns didn't the score Colts. a touchdown against the Browns. They scored with the Colts. With the yeah, Colts, the yeah. Play. That first play, they scored. I want to say it was like forty to sixty yards. One of them, but yeah, yeah bro, Bomb, instantly. instantly. And that was Collins too. That was a man. That was a smooth game, bro. I just really. They just seem like they in sync, and I like that. And they yeah. seem like they having fun. Like CJ Stroud seemed like he just really just having fun. Mm-hmm. And Freshman that's beautiful. With nothing to lose, bro. yeah. He a rookie, bro. He, Mind me of us, man. Twenty eighteen, man. He gonna be here regardless. He yeah. Did. I like that. That I like uh, on the deep level. I like that he proved this up. CJ yeah, Stroud. Yeah, for sure. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah, they were trying to oh, play, yeah. Yeah, trying to play yeah. with that little score test yeah. thingy. Yeah. I like, yeah. What they got to do with the field? Yeah, that's yeah. what I'm saying. I hate that. You know, and you know, draft season coming up, so everybody's the smartest man in the room. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. So you put get on that field. Yeah. You don't know. Nothing. I'm about to say because, and then too, bro. I, personal opinion, but I feel like them scouts be having agendas sometimes because sure. like. The people that they be hyping be the most random person that ain't played against no competition, but sure. you done watch so much of their film that you think they this, this, and mm-hmm. then you end up with, heck, all of North Carolina. If you say you're from North Carolina and you're a quarterback, I instantly don't take you serious. Come on, uh, Mitchell Trubisky, he had one good year, and all of a sudden he's the greatest thing and yep. get to the NFL. And mm-hmm. Will so Levis. Like, Fell by the wayside. And now and they're talking about Drake May, and I'm like, I, I didn't watch any of his games respectfully, but when you say you come from Carolina, I'm already like, okay. Because yeah. your team probably didn't have no success yeah. or anything, but you just. But it's also like, I look at that on the flip side. Like, you you with Alabama, right? It's like, mm-hmm. man, everybody cold. Yeah. Like, what what you going to do when you don't have a. I don't yeah. know. I ain't going to lie to that quarterback. Just, yeah. mm. You know what I'm saying? But I'm talking about just like, I don't know, man. I guess I look at it like that. Uh, the NFL it, it levels it out. I'm glad CJ did, did what he do. Did mm-hmm. what he do because you never really know who's gonna pop. You know, yeah, yeah. yeah it, it ain't nothing to hide behind in the NFL because everybody good. So yeah, what I'm yep. saying. you can't just be. You can't just be. You can't be idea. average. Yeah, yeah, like it's gonna show what you really are at some point. Yeah, exactly. Can't really be hidden too long. Exactly. Dang. Oh, 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 but. <laughs> And that boy that DuPont, man. Yeah, <laughs> he needs. Hey, I got a fresh no mix. Fresh no mix and hard head, man. Yeah, and a walkie. That's crazy. Tweet card. Hey. I'm about to say, he just. And then I don't even, like, I don't think that, well, if anybody watched the game, like, the score ain't, ain't what truly happened. Cause I was like, bro, y'all was getting killed. And then I just came back and go, I stopped watching it. Cause. It wasn't. It wasn't. So I was like, yeah. Then I. Then I. No. 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 What happened? I didn't stop watching. I fell asleep because it was. It was boring to me. <laughs> yeah. And I fell asleep when it was like twenty eight to zero, and I woke up and I was like, oh shoot! I just saw yeah. him focus on my. It's like ball. thirty something yeah. to forty something now. Dang. Yeah. 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 Nah. I'm about oh, to yeah, say yeah. the thing about the Cowboys. That game's gonna always be entertaining. They ain't gonna win. But it's always. But they gonna. It's gonna be entertaining because they gonna make a late. Push at the yeah. end, but it's 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 but every it's funny when they winning, yeah, and it's funny when they losing, yeah. like just you know as a person that be on the different sites, yeah. And stuff. Oh man, I had a good time reading those things. 
I had a good time, you know. I'm waiting for them to get rid of him. Yeah, but because it's really him. Yeah, it's him. Who is him? Dak. Oh, they about to re up his contract. He had an MVP year, fifty nine million. Yeah, I'm about to say he. he That's the problem. That is the problem. But it's all right though. You throw money at it long enough. Yep. I mean, he gonna get his. Shout out to him, though. Yeah, yeah. Get a bag. Yeah. Vinton. But, but I just don't want to hear no Cowboys fan. <laughs> yeah. But I, yeah, it's been episode one thirty four mm-hmm. of the Transferable Experience podcast. Like always, remember to do all the things on all the things. Mm-hmm. Anybody got some wisdom, some science to lead the people with? I need fifteen seconds. Um. No, nah, I'm just playing. <laughs> oh, I was like, go ahead, baby. No, no, no. Everybody be good, man. You know, January, I hope you pops your year off good, bro. Yeah, stay consistent, man. Even if you fall off the wagon, get back on it. Mm. I don't have nothing, man. Y'all live a good life.